Hello, today I'd like to share with you a little box made with the gift box punch board by Stampin' Up. And we have our paper here, it's cut to seven and a half by 11. So basically I just cut one inch off of it. I'm gonna start by lining up one of my edges with this start line. And I'm going to start by punching. Then I'm going to take my scoring tool that comes with it and I'm going to score down from the medium because I have an 11 inch piece and then I'm going to make my little horizontal line. So I'm going to take this score line and I'm going to line it up with this little leg marker and I'm going to punch again. Then I'm going to score along this triangle because I'm going to do a side piece. Then I'm going to score down from the triangle and then I'm going to score down from where it says side. And again, I'm going to make my horizontal line. So I'm going to take this score line and I'm going to, oops, I forgot one of the sides of the triangle. Silly me. Maybe I just didn't go dark enough. And then I'm going to line up this little leg Square my little horizontal punch. And then I'm going to do the medium again because I now I'm doing the front side of the box. I'm just going to ignore this punch. Bring this one all the way over. And now I'm going to do another side. So I'll score the side piece, the triangle, down the box. Punch. And I'm going to bring this, oops, this little piece over to this little leg, and I'm going to punch one more time. I'm going to bring it out. And I'm just going to take my snips and I'm going to snip this piece of the box. This is trash. So this is our box. Just fold our flaps down. I'm going to fold my side pieces. And then my gussets are going to get folded the opposite direction. So I need to do My holes. I don't know if you can see the little knob here. And I'm going to put the sides of my box in so that they line up with those score lines. So this little knob is going to go with the score line. One. Two. Three, four, it should line up, it's not quite lining up, the rest of them are, let's see, and then um, my last one's going to go right on this side. Okay. So now, <clears throat> let's take a step back and we'll put this on. So, and we'll line that up. And I'm just going to punch those holes before I go any further. So, just get that re punched. So, 
there are paper stamps. And our ribbon can go through. Okay. I'm going to take our fast fuse, come down the side of our box, fold that in, and bring our box over, line it up with the top edge. Scooch my fingers out. We've got our box pretty good. This side flap isn't lined up as well as I'd like, but the rest of the holes look pretty good. Okay, and we can take our little lace trim. Put that right through there. This trim really just, it goes through. It's so nice. I'm gonna straighten that up in the back. Here's our little box. Of course, it probably would have been easier to put some little treat in there before I put the tie shut. Or I could have left the bottom open and <clears throat> sealed it up after I showed you, but this is what we've got. So here's our little box.